Guys, Carvana, that's also in focus. Shares are in focus after an epic week amid a major short squeeze. Yahoo Finances, Inez Ferre. Yeah, you know, she's on the case. She's been tracking this one. Shares right now are up by about 2.5%. Inez, help us break this one down. Yeah, this has been a really interesting stock to watch over the last week. But first, let's back up for a second to talk about what short selling is and what a short squeeze is. So short selling is when investors for a fee will sell borrowed shares with the help of a broker and they agree to replace those shares by a later date. That means that they're covering their positions. Now, short sellers are betting that that's, those shares will go down in price and that spread to the downside would be their profit. A short squeeze is when a stock rises and shorts cover their positions, buying back shares at those higher prices, literally getting squeezed out of their positions. And that's what creates that upward movement in the stock price. Now, we saw this happening with Carvana, where Carvana's price moves, and this is a quote from our friends at S3 Partners, Carvana's price move has made it one of the most squeezable stocks in the U.S. with a short interest of 67 percent of the float. The float is the number of shares that are available for trading. And short interest really gives you a sense of how investors feel about a stock, that they believe that the stock will go down in price. Now, Carvana's all-time high, remember, was at $370 back in August of 2021. Last year, the stock was down 98%. This year, year to date, the stock is up about 200% because you are watching short squeezes on that, on that stock and you see it on the screen right now. Other notable names that have also had short squeezes in the past, of course, AMC, GME, you know the drill there. So what are the other squeezable stocks that mm. uh, maybe could be, I mean, Carvana, you know, is not alone. We have seen this happen with some other companies, some of them you just mentioned. Right, exactly. And usually these are companies that are facing challenges. And so investors are betting that share prices will go down. Lucid is another one. Lucid's uh, short interest is 25% of the float. And we saw that stock really squeeze last Friday on that headline that was a speculation of a buyout. So these Headlines are the catalyst, and then they will create this, these massive short squeezes. And in fact, I had an analyst from CFRA Research saying this is why it's so dangerous right now to be in electric vehicle stocks, because they got decimated last year. Investors are betting that the share prices are going to go down, and this creates a short squeeze when you see a headline and the share prices go up. Peloton's another squeezable stock. Open Door, Coinbase, Wayfair, mm. some of these companies, watch out. Squeezable stock. I like that one. That's right. <laughs> Thanks so much. Appreciate it.